y'all so i'm guessing unboxing is just about to be my thing i can't remember the name so i can't intro it with <laughs> with um in front of the video but these are some resistance bands that i ordered because i saw this cool article on well a post on instagram and with me trying to get back into um why is this chair uh get back into working out and being so busy trying to work full time be in school run a business and a half i mm -mm, i need something that's going to give me the most impact with with few with less time put it that way so this is the keto I hope I got the right one. Cause I'm... Okay, the Keto Resistance Band Set. So it comes with that waterproof bag. This is supposed to be a kneeling kind of pad to kind of help you like if you're doing some um, the ground workouts. It comes with a workout guide. Of course I need that so I don't hurt myself. Mmm yes oh okay yeah but it shows you like you know if you got the door anchor and then a lot of the other workouts that you can do with it oh heck yeah i'm about to be skin tea okay <sighs> sorry don't don't pay me any mind i haven't had a nap today um okay so inside of it Ooh. Okay. We have the I think you have the two the two ankle ankle um clamps like depending on what you're doing with the workout. Um then you have the door mount or, or is it door mount? So it's like you put this up under the door or above the door and then you attach them and then do your workout and then you have the actual then you have the handles where you can clamp everything and I believe I paid the the one that I grabbed was like it was $18 so each one of course if you've done any research for resistance bands each one is supposed to be, I guess, equivalent. Each one is, and if y'all hear some weird bubbling noise, I'm trying to make me some vegan spaghetti, so don't pay it no mind. But yeah, each one shows you the weight resistance, meaning, oh, my nails are horrible. Shows you the weight resistance, meaning if I use this one, it's equivalent to uh, lifting that much weight. You fitness experts out there, if that was wrong, please in the comments let me know. But I believe that's what it is. So each one has a weight, a weight up there. And you can actually do different combinations to get different weight variations. So I'm trying to get them together so I can. Let's see here. Okay. So let's do the 40 pound. Ow. The 40 pound and the 30 pound. That's 70 pounds, right? Okay. Oops. So you're just going to clamp them. Okay. Make sure it's centered. And we're going to clamp our 40 pounder on there. I'm going to clamp our 30 pounder on there. Goodness. Okay. I think I did that backwards. Anyways, okay. Clamp it. Okay. Now, the other set that I had a while ago, it was just... It was all stuck together. Like, it didn't give you any kind of variation of resistance size or resistance pressure, whatever you want to call it. 
So I'm clamping the other side. But this will kind of help me, you know, so I don't start off, you know, too, 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 with too much resistance and then, you know, turn around and um, hurt myself. Okay. So we got this. And y'all don't pay attention to my in-house clothes. I'm like bumming, bumming it out today. Okay. So let me just, I just want to see. If this feels like 70 pounds, I don't know. Where should I put you guys? Hold on. Let's do this. So you can at least see the floor. Okay. All right. So I'm going to step on it. Oh, let me go back a little further. Okay. Step on. Ooh. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh yeah, that definitely feels a lot different from the one that I used to have. Oh, I feel that. I'm trying to think, that's all I know how to do. So yeah, that's my, um, I'm, I don't even know what other one I can test. Hold on, let's see. The door anchor one. Hmm. I'll try that later. Let's see what else. Oh yeah, I can, y'all. I can, I don't see anything else I can like try per se. I do know there was one that I've seen people use or do where it's like, uh, I think you do one leg at a time. So you're holding it, right? And then you're just, you go out with it. I don't know if that's right. Again, the comment section is free. If I'm doing it wrong, let me know. I'm always in the spirit of learning. <laughs> so look, that's my review. Um, again, this is the, and I'll link it below, the Keep Toe. The Keep Toe resistance bands. And like I said, I believe I pay like, $18 for these, but I'm going to show you really quick the old ones that I had. Oh, and while we're in here, will it, oh, he won't let me turn it. But this is my workout room. <laughs> That's not really getting used right now. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's, I'm just, I'm so busy. I'm so busy, but before I let you go, this is what I had before. Let me get back into the light. Okay. So this is what I had before. You see how it's like, oh wait, I don't know. I lied. Okay, I guess you could. Okay, never mind. <laughs> anyways i'm not even gonna put them in the video but um those are like so old anyway i don't even know when i got these but the cool thing is about the keep toe brand they seem i think um the thing that i like about them they have that door band thing these didn't, my other ones didn't, where it's like I can do more creative movements with the door, with it being attached to the door, and then it tells me the weight. Some resistance bands don't do that. Now, I'm not, if you did see the name on that other one, I'm not trying to shade anybody or make any other company seem bad. I just want it an updated set so you know you start where you are comfortable comfortable as in body wise or comfortable as in your finances you know that's just my opinion you know because it's a lot of things you could do without equipment but this was just something i wanted and i got it so yeah <laughs> thank you guys as always for watching um 
If you have any workout um, ideas or people that you follow that are really into the resistance bands, link them below. I would love to see them. And yeah, be blessed.